Hello everybody, today, hello everybody, today we are here at Lagoon, we're going to have a fun day, a very summer filled day, we'll call the pre four hours, now he's dead, everything's alive, a little overcast, but you know what, we're going to have a grand time, so let's go take a look at it. So first thing first is, we're going to actually go get some food because we are very hungry, but as you can see, summer's here, the crowds are busy, <laughs> so not bad though, I, I was expecting a lot worse, but you can at least walk. We got our food, we're sitting by the fountain, nice like cloudy day, so it actually feels really good to be outside. A pretzel, some chicken tendies, I know it's our classic, but it's so good. So, we're just gonna enjoy that. So, I was starting to eat, so last time I came here, I was like, oh dang, they stopped doing homemade mustard. It's back, so that's really nice, it's so good. Like, normal mustard's fine, but homemade mustard, even better. All right, so there's a ton of backlight in this area. Also, I, I, I stamped myself. I was sitting like this, and my whole hand is just blue. That, that's cool. Um, let's try out this homemade mustard that I was craving last time. See if it's as good as I remember it being. Ten times better. Ten times better than last time. I'm so happy. So something I've never really done is, so over there, there's the big house where all the restaurants are. But over here is the beer house, and I always thought it was just more bar-esque. But there's a ton of food over here, and I kind of just want to like, take a look. See what we got. So, they got the pretzel, they got pizzas, nachos, chicken tenders, mozzarella sticks. So, pretty much we could have came over here and got the same meal a lot easier. That's kind of cool, and like, there's a variety of drinks over here. It's really nice. So, something to keep in mind, where does it walk out this way? Also, there's a ton of seating over there. So, we're just gonna walk over here in this area and take a look. Yeah, so over here is more like a bar-esque. So, it's kind of cool. So, beer service is over here. So, kind of cool. I was like, why have I never walked in that building? But that's really convenient if you're just wanting some like basic things. So, we're hanging out. Um, this is the line for the train, so you can tell it's quite a busy day. So we're just hanging over here. Woo, it's busy. So usually I'm like kind of used to the crowds, but for some reason it's been a hot second. I'm like, where are we at, Disneyland? So actually the drop rides are back. So the dinosaur drop and also the late bug drop, they were gone. So I'm glad they're not getting rid of them, but it doesn't seem like they're operating today either, which is kind of interesting. All right, so we decided to head over to Bombora because roller coasters sound fun and also this line is going by so fast because they have two carts on. So it's like this keeps pushing people out. So we probably were in the same spot we were last time and we've only been here for maybe three minutes and we're already up here. The last time three minutes we were still back there very far not even into the ride yet. All right here we go. Lagoon Beach is open so now it feels more summery vibes. <laughs> As you can see all the pink tubes. Here we go. Lagoon Beach. Oh God. It's just a fun little smooth little coaster. It's so fun. Just chill vibes. And also we might get some water, who knows? We might have the whole beach experience right now. All right, so we just got up on Bora. As you can see, that's where the line is, all the way down there. But we're actually going here and sneak over to the Lagoon Beach store and see what summer merchandise they have. Surf rags, that's what it's called. Um, girl spinning. <laughs> if you get a little bit of wind in here, that these surfboards go flying. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could call it right. Oh, she's going. She's going. Also, you can get your Crocs here. Well, seven, not not Crocs. 
<laughs> they look, they're really thick. Oh. <laughs> So something kind of cool over there, they have um, towels of all the different rides, which I think is really kind of cool. Like you got the new Primordial ride, Cannibal, kind of fun. I found the Lagoon merch. There's not a ton here. A lot of it's just like swimsuits, duh, this, that. But they got like towels that have embroidered Lagoon, shirts, um, $26. And this has Lagoon on the back, tank tops, hats. I kind of like the white one if you're going to get one. Good Vibes Lagoon, um, Poison, because that, that screams beach vibes, is Poison. But, hold on, let's see what the back, oh, oh, Shipwrecked. That was very confusing. This one has fun colors though. And then, like a uh, compass. It's kind of funny, like, I never realized they had like all these different types of merch for just Laguna Beach. Primordial, I actually really like this one. I think that's a very fun coloring. And then like swim shirts. So kind of cool. All right, so we're going to go and see if the bat has a long line because that sounds kind of fun right now. I mean, also the Odyssey does sound kind of nice because of how hot it is, but that's quite the line for that. It's, it's a debating day, it's a very busy day. All right, so the bat's actually all the way out here, so we are not going to head on the bat, but we are going to check out Primordial. I was assuming bats probably about 45 minutes, so I just, I don't want to wait 45 minutes for a 10 second ride. But Primordial sounds kind of cool to go check out. It should be getting close to being done. So we are going to check out Primordial over here, but it looks like there's a ton of new stuff coming this way. Oh, look at that sign. This is my first time seeing it. That's so cool. And like, what a view. So I knew they were going ahead and start building these um, Dippin' Dots, Coke stands, which look really good, honestly. But Primordial, oh, look at all that rock, look at all that rock work. It's so cool. I just, I don't know if they're gonna be done anytime soon. Like, it feels so close, but so far at the same time. And that's kind of how I feel about this whole thing. But that sign is so cool. I haven't seen that yet. So it looks like we're gonna get one more booth over here. And I don't think there's gonna be restrooms right here just because we have some over here. But, dang, they're getting close. I mean, I bet they are trying to push it as fast as they can right now to get it done so people can come out here. So, it's looking good though. So, rock work and stands and a sign. Ooh, I almost see that at night. So, maybe we'll have to come at night sometime soon because that, I bet that like glows so good. And here's just one more angle, just a little bit to see like the archway into it. It looks kind of tall and I heard there's a couple shops over there. So like those ones like under the cobblestone area, that's kind of more shops. And then the one in the far back where all the smoke's coming from, that's um, the right like stationing building. Man, I bet this line is gonna be huge all the way out here. You know what? I'm willing to take the sacrifice of the little raft ride that used to be right over there. I can't remember what it was called, the, the Hydra Flume, I think it was called for this huge roller coaster. So I don't know if we're gonna do a lot more just because it's pretty busy. So there, there's the Ferris wheel. So I can't quite tell if this is the line for the Ferris wheel or for Cannibal. I might think it might be for Cannibal though. That one line gets crazy busy. Also, I wanna mention we're here on holiday. Um, it's Juneteenth. So a lot of people have it off and I think this is how they wanna celebrate, which is awesome. Just keep it quite busy and scary. See, well, at least we got a little bit of a facade of scary. Bright Mares, is that you? All right, so we're actually going to do whack. Hi. <laughs> All right, we're having a husband off. We're going to see who can get the Yoshi. We're going to whack a mole and see who can get it. So it'll be fun. We're gonna, we're, I'm going to kick his butt. That's how it's going to go. Oh, that's kind of competition. I mean, I have a disadvantage. I have a camera in my hand. Oh, that, that was rude. All right, two rounds. Here we go. Oh gosh. Camera work. Oh, he, he won. He got he got it the first time. Uh -huh. All right, here we go. Here we go. Warm up.
We're, we're good. We're good. We got it. Oh, I got it that time. Do you guys want to combine your stuffed animals to get one small Yoshi or do you guys want to try it? You guys want to Let's just combine it. We'll, we'll, we'll combine it. It goes to the same house. <laughs> Look at Yoshi. <laughs> oh, we got Yoshi. Do you want yellow or green? Yellow or green. 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 Sounds good. Go. Okay. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you. <laughs> what? We got Yoshi. Yeah, Yoshi. <laughs> What we we went in out here, you know, it's really easy to win for us when we have to compete against each other, because there's no losing. It goes to the same house. We're, we're kicking butt. Perks of being married. Married privileges, same price as goes to the same house. Who who would have thought? All right, so we did whack a mole, and honestly, it's really fun, a little expensive, but honestly, it's worth it for Yoshi. We won. He's wanted this to be a biggest display he's going to be on our awards shelf because you know teamwork makes the dream work but thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys have a fun time i know it's a quick trip but honestly we just had like the best of times so thank you so much and we'll see where we decide to roam wander next